Tariq Casaro's rise to the top of the heavyweight division has been swift and to many fans, quite surprising. Making his glory debut in May of 2022, Asaro displayed terrifying KO power throughout the year. But when competing against the upper echelon of the heavyweight division, it was clear he still had room to improve. At the beginning of 2023, the path to a title shot seemed distant for Asaro, in a stacked division that featured rising stars and legends of the sport, it appeared as if Asaro would have to continue to build his way up over the long haul. But things changed quickly in this sport, and for Asaro, so did the trajectory of his career. What's wrong with your knee? Yeah, uh, we uh, of course we uh, went straight to the hospital, got an MRI, and we, uh, we went to a specialist, and he said uh, multiple things are wrong. So uh, yeah, it needs to get fixed. I hope you get your knees good as possible, fast as possible. Whatever you think you need to do, do because I want to beat that Rico, nobody else, no excuses, nothing, just the best version. With heavyweight champion Rico Verhoeven sidelined due to injury and top contender Antonio Plazabot eager to continue competing, the path to a title shot became wide open for all heavyweight contenders. In February of 2023, Glory announced that Plazabot would fight for the interim heavyweight title. In order to determine who his next opponent would be, the promotion organized a four-man heavyweight tournament at Glory 85 in April with the winner earning a chance to compete against Plazabot. When Glory asked Asaro if he'd be interested in participating, he could not have accepted the offer any quicker. I'm very excited to participate in this tournament. So for me, it's again another test to show uh, I belong to the top. So I'm very excited with this chance and opportunity uh, to show you guys the 29th of April what I have in me. In the semifinals of the Glory 85 Heavyweight Tournament, Tariq Asaro faced veteran Jafar Wilness, the most experienced opponent Asaro had ever faced. Many expected Wilness to be a stiff challenge for him. Asaro, however, had other ideas. Corner turn out of there, he goes! Look at Cookie, firing all he's got! Wilness back against the ropes! The ropes keeping him up! Bars out, to be honest. Big knee! Oh, he's out! And that is it! After a dominant performance against Wilness, Asaro advanced to the tournament finals, where he faced Murat Igun, who, like Asaro, had just made quick work of his semifinal opponent. Though Igun was game, Asaro's power proved to be too much. He somehow pushed himself out. Oh, that right hand! Oh. How did Argu not go down? He does there! A right cross Whoa. from Cookie! Waiting in the corner. Oh, that oh. right score! He's down! He's down. and his name is Tariq Cookie Asaro. After being crowned tournament champion, Asaro embraced Plazabat, but acknowledged that their friendship would now have to be put on hold. Plazabat, I love you, but I think we have to give the fans a very good show, bro. We do it in one round, one man standing. We're enemies from now on till the fight is done. 